look at all the leftovers we have. <laughs> Usually you don't have all those leftovers. Usually when you have leftovers, it's bad. <laughs> uh, uh, and you're like, did we assemble this correctly? But we did. But leftovers in this case is good. So good yes. job company, whoever we purchased these from on Amazon. So we'll, we'll put the link out there. Have a great day. Thanks for watching. Mike here. I'm Laura. And it is Saturday and we are Match Made in Heaven. Thanks for watching. Little project, another project on Saturday, honey. Uh, what would you rate this one if one was the simplest and five was the hardest? What would you rate this project today? I would probably rate this one a three and a half, a four, because I couldn't do it by myself. Okay, well, I was going to say three, three out of five. Uh, it's directly behind us, guys, and it's not the shower, it's the shelves. So if you want to watch how we did it, uh, the purchase from Amazon, uh, continue watching. Thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe if you like our channel. Turn on the notifications. Hit that little bell icon. Uh, but uh, this was a pretty easy project, and uh, three shelves that are on the wall behind us. And, Laura, and also... Happy? Also, we will put a link to these uh, brackets on our video. I would highly recommend this company. All right, Laura, what are we doing? I have no idea. You know. Come on. I'm trying to match up the corners. So, these are her shelves for the master bath. Yes. She wanted some, what would you call this? Trim? Yes. I wanted to trim them out so that they're not just square. So you purchase some trim from um, Lowe's. Lowe's to match the width of the shelf. Yes. What have we done so far? We've measured so cut 45s. So far we've measured and cut 45s. So now what we're going to do is use the brad nailer. And we've got some 5 8 inch, 5 8 <laughs> inch. Brad Nails. Uh, this is another Harbor Freight uh, purchase here, guys. Working well for us. And uh, we're going to nail this on. See if we can make these shelves look a little bit more special. One thing we did, we cut one of the trim pieces too short. How did we fix that, Laura? Cut the board. We cut the shelf a blade shorter. <laughs> Because we didn't have <laughs> enough trim. We didn't have enough trim to cut another piece. We were about... Mm, two Eighth of an inch, something. Two it was sixteenths not a lot. of an inch. So we just cut a blade off the. Uh, we got a blade shorter on one of the shelves. So don't forget about fixes like that if you need to. Hey guys, Laura here. We are getting ready to install some shelves in our bathroom, and then the bathroom will almost be complete. I just got to buy another cabinet for in here, but. Um, to install the shelves, we bought these uh, metal brackets, industrial looking brackets from Amazon. We got a set of six for $30.99 and they come made like this, this piece. And then you have your brackets for your wall and your shelf. So all you have to do is screw these pieces together like that. I'm not going to tighten them because it's going to take too much time. And then you put this one like that. Your shelf sits on that one. And that one goes on your wall. And it'll set like that. So we are going to install these. And first we have to find our studs and decide the distance we want them apart. And then we will get back with you and show you the finished product. Hey guys, just a tip. Um, in the past when we've had to use these little, uh, you're not going to talk about me, are you? Plastic anchors. She's talking about when me, you guys. miss the stud and you have to put these in the drywall, um, instead of using a punch like this, this is a nail set punch. Instead of using these, which we've done in the past and made the hole too large, what we decided to do was find a drill bit that will fit inside the hole of that and then you know it's the hole will be big enough to put your 
anchor in. So that's what we did and it worked out perfect. So you're saying me doing a nail punch is inconsistent and this method is consistent? Correct, because the drill bit is the same diameter when you use oops, a nail set. If you look closely, the nail set, it starts out small and ends up big. So the farther you put it in the wall, the bigger the hole gets. It's faster. But it's, it's faster, but it's inconsistent and it does not work. We've tried it multiple times. Good tip, Laura. Thanks for sharing.